He has made the base already? The builder works fast, a bit too fast. and I seek. There's no higher peak.
This looks like the right place. I swear, dwarves would choose riddling over rutting. Let's see what you can make of these, Ivaldi. How is he building that tower so quickly? There's more to this stranger than meets the eye. I know a cat's footfall when I... I found everything you asked for. How soon can you finish this unbreakable cord? As soon as it wants to be made. You cannot rush this kind of magic. It flows with a speed all its own. Find me as soon as it's ready. By the way, after we spoke of the Hooger, a cousin came by with his own spirit tale. I don't trust coincidence, so this one's free. What did he say? He told me his sister's husband, Borin, drank a mead brewed in Jotunheim, and it sent his hooger into a goat. The spirit of a dwarf in the body of a goat? 
Stranger still, his sister didn't even notice. Heavy! Don't drag me into this. The tower is nearly finished. Do not fret. The final hours are ticking down. Not fast enough. I feel the jaws of a trap closing upon me. Knowing you are in a trap is the first step to avoiding it. You don't care if I'm married off to this builder, do you? You are the Queen of Asgard, the host of Folkvanga, the Shepherd of the Slain. Of course I care. Yet you act as if I'm some treasure to be traded about. I was wrong to use you like that. I will confront the Builder and pry the truth out of him. A limp apology, but it will suffice for now. Once the Builder is dealt with, turn your spear on Loki. Every chance he had, he dug us deeper into this mess. If Loki is up to something, I will see to it that he is punished. Blood Oath be damned. Like what you see? Quite the tower. Hmm. Mm, tall and not my best work, but it has a certain glow. Now then, where's my queen? You're finished. The tower is functional. One rune remains, which I shall inscribe after I am wet. Who helped you complete the work, Builder? You could not have managed so quickly on your own. Our agreement said nothing about outside help. Now, where is Frey? I tire of waiting. Outside help. Interesting choice of words. Hail, Harvey! Hail, Builder! We bring you your bride! Freya, my beloved!
Why does she leer so wickedly? Freya is so excited that she has refused food or drink until the marriage is consummated. I'm pleased, but somewhat surprised since this unwilling union was thrust upon her sight unseen. Once she saw this tower, a testament to your strength, she knew you to be a great man indeed. Enough chatter. We have upheld our end of the bargain. Will you finish your work? I'm sorry, but I've never seen such wild eyes. Why does she look so feral? Since hearing of your offer, she has not closed her eyes. She fears what she might miss in the abyss of comforting sleep. This is no dream, my love. It is all quite real. Speak and tell me you agree. Quit stalling and kiss her, Dungmeat! Consummate your betrothal! Yes, a kiss. A brief taste to whet my appetite. <clears throat> Delicious! Your lips are two <laughs> pillows on a bed of rain-rose petals. And yours are cold and rough as unpolished stone. What trickery is this? Is something wrong? Her voice! It's hideous! I have been told it has a seductive quality. By a wolf. Treachery! Bring me the real fray, or my offer is withdrawn! I'll bring myself, if you don't mind. Freya, you don't need you to... You have next to nothing, Esir. Only this useless monument to your ineptitude. Uh... You've been a good boy, Thor. Don't gamble your winnings. <clears throat> and you, Havi. You tried to avoid responsibility by not making a choice, but that was a choice in itself. And look where it has brought us. We have taken you for granted, it is true. That ends now. Has this sad spectacle been for my sake alone? I've seen better drama on the festering carcass of a dead pig! Finish your work, or suffer. No Freya, no shield. To hell I am with him, Harvey. I know where he keeps his enchanted paint. Show me. Thor, Tyr, watch our guests closely. Freya, I hope we will have words when this is done. Why do you still wear Freya's form? A reminder of who's at stake. Chains back. This is disturbing. Where do we go now? I don't know. I didn't say I was watching him every moment. So you do not know where he kept his supply? not be seen in this area. See you, old friend.
We have found the worm's lair. Are those the builder's pets? Shifters. More deception. The builder will suffer for this. What is it, Harvey? Loki? Did you know this builder before we met him at Heimdall's tower? Did I know him? As in friends? Or know of him? Did you invite him here? I... I did, yes. He rescued my son from Jotunheim, so I agreed to bring him here and help him find work. That's all. Make this right, Loki. Or the blood oath that binds me is forfeit. For you and your son, is that clear? As a cloudless sky, High One. Mordia. I'll hurt your back. That's cold comfort. Leave me his blood. Loki, slay these shapeshifters. That all of them. I hope so. Let's get the paint and go. I have the paint. Then let us fade like shadows in the light. On your advice. Find some way to hinder his efforts, or I will offer you as his price. Our Harvey returns. Stay right there, Builder. We're not finished with you. <clears throat> you survived my trap. How disappointing. Invaders from Jotunheim. We slaughtered them all. Buris Balsack! Can I kill him now? We do not need this honor cheat. We will complete the tower ourselves. My Hoogr makes it work. I am bound to it through the magic of your realm. You perverted our sacred waters. We have every reason to kill you. Well reasoned. They should call you the god of hindsight, all-knowing after the fact. I will finish the inscription. Builder, you stay with me. You others go. Elhas, for protection.
You godless worm. Slayer of my kin. Oathbreaker. Spirit taker. I didn't build this tower to keep your enemies out. I built it to keep you in. my people without punishment or price? You and your slab-headed son? Their lives were the price they carried. But you do not control them. Control them? I only wish to survive them. Your time has passed. There's no turning back the seasons. If our doom is assured, I will ensure that you share it. Is the Jotun dead? And his magic dies with him. Does that worry you, trickster? What are you implying? Were you behind this? You dishonorable truth tangler. What do you know of honor, Freya? You've bedded more men than all the halls in Midgard. You're a fine one to talk of sexual appetites. You fathered a wolf cub. I'll not hear a lecture from the Lord of Petty Rules, who stiffens at the thought of laying down the law. And before you threaten to brandish your hammer, Thor, remember, without it, you'd be no better than a troll. Only twice as stupid. Oh! You festering ball sack swollen with the foulest drippings of Emir's corpse. No oath is worth this abuse. But you won't break it, Harvey. You cannot. All your efforts to evade destiny will only fling you further along its course. If you're not careful, you may be the author of your own destruction. Huh? Leave him. He will do little harm while his son remains captive. 
A mouthful of iron would put a stop to his babbling. What now, wise one? We have returned to the place from which we set out. Ragnarok is coming, and we are no safer. There may be a solution in Jotunheim. Hooger magic, they call it. I will travel there to see it for myself. Until I have the final binding, Lokistan must not leave that island. In time, it shall serve as a sanctuary for all wolves. I will watch over him, as one of my own kin. Then I'll leave the realm in your capable hands, my queen. If my own are empty when I return, I will accept destiny with both.
Welcome back. Your face is bright, and your eyes seem clearer. Tell me of everything you have seen. I... Uh, I have been to Asgard, the seat of the gods. I saw through Odin's eyes, just as you said. In every vision, I inhabited his form, lived as he once lived. In his body, I was myself, but I was carried by his whims. His thoughts were as known to me as my own. We were two, but we existed as one. And what have you learned? More than learned, I felt. I felt everything. His fears and doubts, his loves and passions. Incredible. What else? I consorted with Loki, the trickster. We quarreled often, as siblings. But soon our fights grew dark. When he revealed he had sighed a wolf cup, my rage was unbound. Because he had hid the truth from you? Yes, because he knew that wolves were not allowed in Asgard. He flaunted my command. Perhaps this was the purpose of your vision. To overcome an inner fear and find forgiveness in your heart. Maybe. But before my vision ended, I was seized by great purpose. I devised a plan. A voyage to Jotunheim. And then... I awoke. Interesting. Was there anything else? I heard a prophecy. Warning of Ragnarok. The destruction of the world. The end of all time. And the Nornir. They warned me of the great wolf Fenrir. And how he hungered for my blood. But there is something else. Hope. I was undaunted by the coming cataclysm. Perhaps this aspect of your vision inspires bravery. Truly, you are touched by the gods. Was there more? There was nothing more. Nothing of great significance. The dream is faded. Eivor, your visions are unlike any I have encountered. Leave me now. I must think on what you have shared.